Assalamu alaikum, I am Fahim and in today's video I am going to show you how we can rename a table name. Now as you can see I already have a table named students in a database named student database. Let's say I want to change the table name from students to something else. Let's say people. So how can I do that using my SQL query command? Let me show you first. So first of all, I need to alter the table name, right? So as I want to alter something, I have to tell it, hey, SQL, I want to alter something. So I am using alter. And then I have to specify which thing I need to alter right now. Do I need to alter a table? Do I need to alter a database? Or do I need to alter anything else? Obviously, I need to alter a table. So I will specify, hey, my SQL, I want to alter a table. So alter table. And then I have to specify the current table name. The current table name is students, all right? And now I need to tell it in which name I want to change the table name to, all right? So let's say I want to change my table name from students to people, to people. So I will use the keyword to. And now I have to give the name, or you can say I have to give the new name of the table. All right. So as I want to name the table name from students to people, so I would use people. And I need to use a semicolon to specify that the statement is already finished. And if I simply execute it, I am getting an error. Why is that? Because I have missed something. If you have watched my earlier video regarding alter, then you might be wondering that I am missing a keyword properly. Yes, you are right because I am missing the rename statement. So as you can see, I have used alter table and the table name. So I have specified, hey, MySQL, I want to alter students table. And now I need to specify which thing I want to do right now. Do I need to edit, update or delete or something like that? I want to simply rename the table name. So I have to use rename. And then I have to tell it the new name of the table. So alter table, table name. I want to rename it. So rename. And I want to rename it from students to people. So rename to and then I have to provide the table name. Now if I simply execute it, it's accepted a green checkbox and if I simply reload the schema, you see that the name has been changed to people. And let's say I want to change the name from people to students again. So what would happen? Alter table and the current table name and that is people and rename to the new table name that would be student. And if I simply execute it, you see a green checkbox. If I simply reload it, you see the name has been reverted back to student. So that's how we can rename any table name we want. If you are new to this channel, then please consider subscribing to this channel. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends. And if you want, you can follow me in GitHub, GitLab, LinkedIn, Twitter, Instagram. I'll provide all of the link in this video's description box. So that's it, everyone. Thank you. And I will see you in another video. Till then, take care. Ta -ta.